May, but it feels a lot more like July and people got out and enjoyed it. But the warm weather comes with a warning about staying safe on the water. WGN's Patrick Elwood has more. With the warmer weather arriving, people are definitely getting out on the water. And whether it's the big lake like Lake Michigan or any of the smaller lakes in the area, a day of fun can go south real fast. Two paddle boarders learned that the hard way today. As a mom to, to young boys, um, we like to stay close to our boat and close into the in the harbor. That's Andrea, mother to Tyson and Jordan. Her mantra with her 11 year olds is always, always play it safe on the lake. Obviously, there's a lot of danger involved. Earlier today, two paddle boarders found that out the hard way. The Chicago Fire Department reports it transported two people from Montrose Harbor to a local hospital. The two drifted about a mile out, ran into some trouble, and then had to be assisted by a private boater. That news comes as the fire department put out word today about safety on the water in general. With a busy Memorial Day weekend just around the corner, the CFD Marine Unit practiced a water rescue today with a reminder about the dangers of alcohol. More and more boaters on the water, you want to be aware of OUIs, which is operating under the influence. It's the same as a DUI. You have a 0.08 blood alcohol level on a boat. Please be aware, though, boaters on the water, when you factor in sunlight, wind, waves, the amount of time on your water, you are already losing your senses. Earlier this month, three boaters had to be rescued and another went missing out of East Chicago when their boat started taking water soon after they got out. Back to Andrea and her parental instincts. She knows how dangerous the lake can be in just a matter of moments. Especially if you're not prepared, it's very cold still. The yeah. water is cold. If you don't have anything to you know, call right. for the Coast Guard or anything, then you're in a lot of trouble. Those paddle boaters were hospitalized again, but they are going to be okay. Obviously, a very traumatic experience. Reported from Montrose Harbor, Patrick Elwood, WGN News.